Delighted to be able to report that the weather has cooperated here at the Emirates Stadium in North London. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is the former Arsenal defender, Lee Dixon. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Arsenal up against Leeds United. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Always my favourite time of the week, spending time with you at games. We should be in for a belter here with these two. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Bernd Leno gets the nod in goal. Mohamed Elneny starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch. And leading the line today is the hard to defend against Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. And a look at the Leeds United starting 11. An element of caution about this selection. Yeah, 4 5 1, Derek. The five players behind the lone striker will need to support him. Looks very strong midfield offensively and also defensively. The back four will be protected throughout the game. Thank you for attending the Emirates Stadium. Enjoy the game. Well, this game should offer plenty. Arsenal get it going. Tierney. Bukayo Saka. Jacka with it. Elneny. Holding now. Into the advanced position. Pepe Alioski Jack Harrison has it Mateusz Klich and the pass could do damage an early goal it is the ideal opening Well, as we can see, it's all about the technique. That's where the power comes from. Blistering shot. Arsenal restart the game then. And they have work to do as they try to wipe out that last goal. Bukayo Saka. Jaka with it. Saka. Granit Jaka. That's how to rob them of possession. Possession changing hands. Obama Yang. El Nenny with it. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Xhaka. And will it be the level out? Oh, he's missed it, Lee. Still plenty of time to go, Derek, but they won't get a better chance than that. Possession changes hands, the interception there. Ailing. And Rodrigo has it. Calvin Phillips. It's Arsenal's turn now. Mateusz Klich. 
Good looking sequence. Cleach. And space for the cross. It's opening up for them and delivered towards the back post. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Saka. A room to roam on the wing. Intercepting it intelligently. Harrison. And Rodrigo has it. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? Now let's see about the cross. Cleared away. Granite Jacker. Bukayo Saka. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Pepe. Can he get them level? And it's gone in. Beyond the goalkeeper, Arsenal level. Well, let's just look at this again. Just when you think you've got a team by the scruff of the neck, they break on you like that. What pace, what brilliance. Just look at the movement. It's a brilliant, brilliant goal. Well, you can see how happy the manager is. They've shown real grit to get back into this. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Harrison. High quality defending. Saka. Jacker with it. Obama Young. Hector Bellerin. Now with Obama Young. Arsenal completely controlling possession, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. The press was on and it worked. Now oh, that pass easy on the eye. A goal here, giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, here's the replay, and what a ball that is to put him through. And he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, the coach has to be happy with that. Got their noses in front. Still work to be done, though. And underway again. Arsenal, other side in front. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. El Nenny. Saka. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Rafinha. And Rodrigo has it. And taken away. Untidy in possession. An attack full of promise. What can he do from here? Tremendous block. Well, he didn't have it quite on the target, Lee. Oh, it was a great opportunity. Sometimes you've got a choice, power or placement. He should have put his laces through it. Granite Jacker. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? 
Well, his manager will be delighted with him. He's been spot on in this game, hasn't he? Energy, imagination, desire, and a steely determination. Oh, he's through here. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, here it is again. The through ball is perfectly timed. It causes havoc, and he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. Stuart Dallas. And Rodrigo has it. Really getting stuck in. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. End product or not. In with a chance! It has to be, surely. And a goal to increase their advantage to three. Can they be stopped? Well, in this replay, you're going to see a 2v1 against the keeper. How does that happen? He'll be asking his defence why he was left exposed. Nothing he could do. Well, there's nothing better for a manager when a plan comes together. Total satisfaction. So back with the action, and Arsenal sprinting away with ease. Holding. Granite Jacker. Arsenal certainly enjoying the lion's share of possession. Really starting to dictate the tempo of this game now. And they're creating chances as well. I'm not sure their opponents seem to have the answer, to be honest. They can't seem to get a foothold in this game. Crossing possibilities. It is to be a throw-in. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And there to intervene. Wonderfully weighted pass. It should be. Oh, good save. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. But oh, he's gone short with it. Aubameyang. And able to get a body in the way. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Dangerous looking attack. Patrick Bamford. Jack Harrison has it. Can they get in behind them? And the cross smuggled away. 15 minutes remaining. Promising sequence. Might be a chance here. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Roberts. Cleach. Jack Harrison has it. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. And that'll be offside. Time for a change then. Nicola Pepe. Elneny with it. 
And making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. And space for the cross. Well, unable to hold his run, and that's offside. And time for the change now. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Obama Yang, and he takes on the shot. And the keeper was up to the task. Corner kick given to Arsenal. Played into the centre of the box. A goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, that's like the other end, the striker putting it in the net. The goalkeeper has to keep it out, and what a brilliant way to do it. Makes his way in field. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Well, he took care of it defensively. And he's fired over the corner. Pepe. Oh, a smart stop. Corner again. They've lost possession here, Arsenal. And he saw the situation developing. Elder Costa, he'd really have to switch on the turbo to get to that pass. And the referee blows his whistle. Now we can say it officially, Arsenal have won this game. Three points picked up, Lee. Well, being potent up front gives you a great chance in any game. And they were certainly that today. Sharp, clinical and exciting to watch for sure. Well, the cameras get up close and personal with Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang with good cause. Well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well, looked really sharp, constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real handful.